Pumpkin Day. Daddy, it's Pumpkin Day, said Trudy one October morning. The day we have pumpkin pancakes for breakfast, he asked. Yes, said Trudy. The day we go to pick out pumpkins and buy pumpkin pie. Yes, Daddy, shouted Trudy and Jack together. Good morning, said Mrs. Bell. There are lots of pumpkins in the pumpkin patch. We have miniatures, pumpkins for cooking and eating, pumpkins for carving, and one that is very special. I'm sure you'll find it. Trudy, what do the signs say? asked Jack. Trudy read, Welcome to Pumpkin Hollow Farm. It took between 90 and 120 days to grow these pumpkins. Please don't sit or climb on them. Please don't pick up the pumpkins by their stems. Thank you, Mrs. Bell. Joke! What does a pumpkin sow? A pumpkin patch! In the fields behind the farm stand, there were small pumpkins and tall pumpkins, round pumpkins and skinny pumpkins, big pumpkins and bumpy pumpkins. I like this wrinkly one, said Trudy. Jack patted the pumpkins. They made a thump sound. I want this one, he said. Trudy, do pumpkins grow on trees? No, Jack, they grow on vines, she answered. That's right, said Mrs. Bell. We plant the seeds in the spring after the last frost. They sprout, then grow into vines. The vines grow really long, as long as a house with lots of big leaves. At this time of year, the vines are shriveling up. But look, here's a female pumpkin flower. A pumpkin grows from the swelling at the base of the flower. It's green and small, said Trudy. How do pumpkins grow so big? And orange, added Jack. Mrs. Bell took some pictures from her pocket. Well, with the leaves making food and the roots growing in good rich soil and with the right amount of sun and water and fertilizer and weeding and bug control, the pumpkins will grow from late summer to harvest time. Night and day they grow bigger. And bigger and bigger. Trudy and Jack joined in. The word pumpkin comes from a Latin word, peepo. Peepo, they both giggled. Mrs. Bell laughed too. Yes, peepo, it means ripened by the sun. As the pumpkin ripens, what happens to the color? It changes, exclaimed Trudy. Look, Trudy, this is the one I want, yelled Jack. Wow, Trudy shouted. It is a Maxima variety, said Mrs. Bell. Maximas can gain as much as five pounds a day. I wish it were the kind for making pies. It would sure make a lot of them, said Dad. Yum. Who's going to carry this giant pumpkin home, Mom asked. Then she said, I will. Can you guess how? As a memory. Say pumpkin pie, please. Click. They picked out their pumpkins and followed Mrs. Bell back to the farm stand. What do the signs say, Trudy? asked Jack. Trudy read, the parts of a pumpkin, stem, shell, flesh, pulp, seeds. Mom, look at the baby pumpkins, said Trudy. Those are baby boos, said Mom. They are full grown, just a miniature variety. We can buy a few for decorating and some pumpkin bread mix and a pumpkin treat for supper. As soon as they got home, Trudy and Jack practiced drawing pumpkin faces on paper. Then they drew faces on their pumpkins. I want my pumpkin to have ears, said Trudy and to be really scary. Dad cut out lids so Trudy and Jack could reach inside. They rolled up their sleeves and scooped. It's all stringy and gooey, said Trudy. Look, Trudy, seeds. 
We can dry some and save them in a jar and plant them next spring, she said. They scrape the insides clean with big spoons. Rudy used an apple corer to carve out a nose. Mom and Dad carved the pumpkins' faces. Jack, our pumpkins are turning into jack-o'-lanterns, said Trudy. In olden times, they hollowed out potatoes and turnips and beets for lanterns. They cut out a little window and put a burning coal inside for light. They called those early jack-o'-lanterns bogeys, said Dad. Bogeys, they all giggled. Mom and Dad and Trudy and Jack made a special pumpkin day supper. Well, hooray for pumpkin day, declared Dad, and pass the pumpkin pancakes, please. After breakfast, they walked to Pumpkin Hollow Farm. The yellow and orange leaves glowed against the clear blue sky. The fallen leaves made a crunch, crunch, crunch sound under their feet. They ate pumpkin muffins, toasted pumpkin seeds sprinkled on salad, and for dessert, pumpkin pie. Trudy looked over at the pumpkins. Finally, it was dark outside. Mom, she whispered, it's time. Jack turned out the lights. Ooh, boo, 